Net. Troy women's basketball team got a lot of it after they won the Sun Belt Conference in Pensacola, executing head coach Rigby's plan, knowing Louisiana would go after Alexis for her double-double record, left the perfect net of opportunity. We just feel really blessed to be to be in this situation. Um, there would never be an easy championship against Louisiana Lafayette and Gary Broadhead. The ability of our players to keep the belief that we're going to win, I mean, I think that that says it all. They, they never flinched. They believed, no matter how close it got, that they were going to win, and they were able. that belief was able to, to make them make good decisions and make good plays. They had a lot of senior leadership, but we did as well. You know, we did as well, and we, we've got people who've been in some horrific battles to try to win, even, even throughout this tournament. Having some players show not only their hearts for Troy, but their skills, head coach Shanda Rigby says it was more than necessary. They were focusing on her a great deal, which which left other people open and other people stepped up. And I can't say enough about the people who came off the bench and really did their jobs. And um, that made it difficult uh, because even though Louisiana Lafayette had a great game plan and they were executing it very well, it was the people who came in off the bench in the first half that enabled us to have a lead at halftime. Louisiana being a tough team defensively, rebounds and boxing out is what came down to the end of the game for the Trojans. With senior Alexis Dye finishing off this season heading into the tournament, says continuing to practice for any kind of turnover is critical. We were kind of like slowing down, trying to play their tempo when we should have been playing our tempo. Without rebounds, we probably wouldn't have won this game. Um, rebounds is a key thing in what we do each and every day. That's why we practice on it each and every day. Not being able to celebrate like they normally would, the Trojans are now all bubble buddies for the safety of themselves and other teams. Being the Sun Belt Conference champions, the Trojan women will head into their fifth season, which for them is the NCAA tournament. We'll stay in our bubble and um, stay focused. We have to get rested and recuperated. We want to be the most prepared team peaking at the right time when we get to that tournament, so we still have a lot to push for.